Well, it's one of the most entertaining and inspiring shows on TV. We are, of course, talking about American Ninja Warrior. And any, even if you don't watch the show where elite athletes test their limits on a harsh obstacle course, you might have seen this clip a few moments ago, a few months ago. No, we don't have the clip. Okay. Our, uh, our system apparently has taken Friday off. But anyways, we are talking about them coming this weekend and the man under the costume, which we will show you, and fellow competitor Mac, he's here in Jacksonville. You brought your friend, too. Who's this guy? Uh, I'm Rico Rivera. I was the guy in the T-Rex suit. Okay. This is my buddy Mac. I was Trey wondering Carter. because I yeah. couldn't see the face in there. I know he looks like a T-Rex because he's the biggest one, but <laughs> it's not actually him. Okay. Well, uh, welcome to you both. Thank you so much. Thank Thanks you. for having us. Yeah, I'm glad you guys are here in Jacksonville. Tell us why you're here in Jacksonville. Absolutely. Uh, we're doing an event tomorrow at Rebounders Jacksonville. It's a Ninja Warrior-themed event. Uh, it's for kids in all ages. Uh, it's competition. It's fun. Grand opening. They just opened a Ninja Warrior part, and uh, we're hosting. So you're going to show us your cool moves? Oh, yep. Yeah. We're going to do a meet and greet, sign some autographs, have a lot of fun, uh, visit the city. We love this city. We just took a look at the beach this morning, and it was beautiful out. It was a beautiful sunrise, wasn't <laughs> yeah. it? Oh, yeah. And, and, Mac, tell me, did you bring the T-Rex costume? It's Rico. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I, again, I, I can't see That's it. Okay. There That's it is, okay. right there. Uh, the T-Rex suit is out of commission at the moment. A little training, a little too hard. Oh, so did, I didn't did bring it break? It with me, unfortunately, yeah. So uh, not today, but you so, can catch it online, YouTube. Just type in Rico T-Rex, and you'll find it. So I've watched American Ninja Warrior, and mm -hmm. some of the things you guys do are just really not even human. How do you train for that? How do you start for that? Because most of us grew up playing baseball or basketball well, or football. This is totally different. Well, one thing's for sure. You got to be able to do some pull-ups. Okay. So get on those pull-ups. You got to be athletic. Do we have a pull-up bar yeah. here? <laughs> no. You can hang on pretty much anything, though, even a ledge, even a doorway. You know, get on there and get those fingers and that grip strength going because that's what you're going to need for Ninja Warrior. And when did you guys start training for this? Uh, I personally started training in 2012. Uh, I've been on the show five times. Uh, Mac's been training all kinds of other obstacle courses and stuff for many years, but it was his first season this year, and he killed it. So as kids, were you always good? Were you always climbing trees and jumping ditches and doing right. all kinds huh? of crazy stuff? Oh, yeah. I was falling out of trees three stories high and surviving. <laughs> okay, and... so you learned from your mistakes a little yeah, bit. Yeah, exactly. I think uh, a lot of the ninjas have that in common. We used to all jump off trees, jump off roofs and just jumping around and couldn't contain us. So this show translated into a big game of uh, don't touch the lava for us. So. And you've probably all had some pretty gnarly injuries. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, pulled my shoulder, knee, back. What about you? I've been pretty lucky. <laughs> I haven't had really? really too many injuries, nothing that really pops in my head that really slowed me down or stopped me, no. So you're jumping and flipping and flying and all that, nothing major. Well, I'm getting those uh, backflips in now. Uh, I've been going to the gymnastics gym with the padded floor. I've been practicing that with Rico, and that's uh, in the works. Okay, so <laughs> it's exciting. The kids, I'm sure you have quite the following of children and, and adults that watch the show and love sure. the show and love you guys. You yeah, guys are they, celebrities now. They love the show. Uh, I don't know about celebrity, sorry, but, I mean, some people do, do know us. Some of the kids, they follow the show. They know everybody's name, like where they went out on, their backstories, their families. So it's pretty cool. It's fun to inspire the youth, and that's something that I really believe in myself. Okay, and, and they, know, they know you for the T-Rex, and they know you for your face. <laughs> right. Well, they know me from the crown. The, the crown. king of obstacles is my the name. The king. Yes. I, I'm so sorry. I didn't know I was sitting here with the king. Well, I thought you were the Burger King, but you're the king of obstacles. No, king of obstacles. You probably don't eat too many cheeseburgers. No. I was also on another obstacle show, uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin's Broken Skull Challenge on the Country Music Channel. Okay. Uh, season 2, Episode 1 winner. So there's a mile obstacle course there. Uh, I like it. I like it. Well, thanks so much, guys. Appreciate you guys coming yeah, on. And, thank you. And Appreciate awesome. it. Yeah, I'm awesome singing Kung Fu Fighting. So you guys have fun this weekend, Don't okay? Don't forget about our social media, our okay. Facebook, <laughs> our won't. Instagram, Yeah, let's put Twitter. it online. All right. The American Ninja Warrior event is Saturday beginning at 3 p.m. It's at Rebounders on Old St. Augustine Road. We've posted a link where you can buy tickets on the morning show page of newsforjacks.com. We'll also post a link for your social media accounts awesome. so people can follow you guys.